Okay. So you finish put your clothes. So that's your silly glasses, your reading glasses. Uh, uh, let's read so you could play before you go to school. All right. What's the title? You said you were going to wait. Go ahead. Now I'm here. Read the, what's the title? X marks the spot. Okay. Do you know who the author is? Yeah. Let's look. <clears throat> okay, what does this say? It's Illustrated by, by Art, Art Money, right? Mm -hmm. So that's who who the who is the illustrator? What does the illustrator do? Um he draws the, okay. the, the, the pictures and the, the story. Picture. Now it says story by R. Schuler Hook. So that's the author when they say story by okay. The author writes the word. Yes, the author write the word. Alright, so let's read. Here. What is this? Beneath? Beneath my cap. You're right here. Whoa. Uh-uh. What? Who? Who put this here? It looks like a map. Okay. This is a map that we have got and look and X, X watch the spot. Okay. Not just one X. This map has more some maps. Don't maps. stop because there's no period. Okay? Mm -hmm. Some maps. Some maps. You're right here. So, okay, maybe you need to take the glasses off because you can't see, right? Some maps has one. This map has four. Okay. Two. Dino. Dino. Put it like that so I can see. To Dino World. World. We have to go. What will we find? We do not know. Okay. Hold up the book. Turn the page. How did you do that? How did you do that? Okay, today is April 11, 2018, and it's 9.33. Uh, just like yesterday, I went to the gym um, around 7.15ish. I think I got there at 7.30. Um, I did what I need to do with the kids. I read with my youngest. Um, so I was just sitting around. They ate. They did what they were supposed to do, so I was able to finish with them really quick. So I told my husband I'm just going to go to the gym so I could uh, finish uh, early. I didn't really had <clears throat> I didn't really have to go today because on, on Monday I did legs, yesterday, Tuesday I did uh, uh, some upper bodies and arms and stuff like that. And today I could have rest but because tomorrow is going to be one of my busiest days. I'm gonna go on a trip with my youngest uh, so I volunteered to go and I had to pay for it even though I volunteered we're gonna go to Liberty Science Center so I will not be going to the gym um, I'm not sure if I I don't think I'm gonna record tomorrow uh, because uh, the teacher sent me an email saying that they're gonna give me uh, put me in a group so I'm gonna take care of a couple kids so I don't wanna put other kids uh, other kids on my video so uh, I will not be recording if I record that's probably because their faces are not uh, in it or something like that so um, whatever I can I'll be showing you guys but it probably will be on my family channel so I went to the gym today um, I didn't really have anything specific in mind um, I just wanted to do something, um, especially uh, 
uh, it's not like I'm not, uh, what's the term? Um, it's not like I don't have any motivation. Uh, I'm just a bit, I guess, tired. So I just push myself to go. So uh, if I don't go, um, I probably will create a habit of not going. So I push myself to go. Um, so when I got there, just like yesterday, I don't recommend that. I didn't stretch at all. I didn't do any stretching. So I just did um, some uh, two handle uh, lat pull down. I did my regular routines and stuff like that. And uh, what, as soon as I finished, the leg press was available. So I was like, you know what? I did bring my camera with me. I said, let me record uh, the thing that I explained yesterday on my yesterday video that I did not mention on Monday's video of how I did the leg press. So I did the exact same thing. Um, so I will show you that. If I didn't uh, edit that video, I would have put today's video along with it together but I already edited it. It was a short video so I just edited and uploaded it to get it out of the way. So um, I did that. Um, I'll probably, I think I still have that uh, uh, edit video. I'll put uh, how I did that uh, leg press. One thing I forgot uh, uh, when I did uh, the leg press without the uh, uh, any weights on it, I, I, I only did the, the first set, I only did, uh, uh, what is it, I think it was close stents, um, I didn't do the wide stents, but I made it up on my last, uh, on my last set, when I removed, after I did all the, uh, the sets, and then uh, when I didn't have any um, plates on the machine, so I did what I um, then do at the beginning, so I made it up. Um, so pretty much, after that, I did some variety of stuff, some upper body, um, was it uh, some back exercises and I did the seated uh, uh, calf raises. Um, yesterday I did uh, arm and shoulders with the cable. Today I did it with the dumbbell. So I did couple biceps curl. Um, I started at 20. Uh, my, my strength with the biceps, uh, bicep uh, curl have gone down before I used to start at 25 there are time I'll start at 30 with the dumbbells and then go down the rack so my strength has you know reduced tremendously so I started with the 20 and I got up to I believe it was 12.5 um, after that uh, the weight were too light so I just did two sets of that so I did 20 and then go down the rack until 12.5 uh, and then do another set at 20 all the way to 12.5 and I did some I did 21 with the 30 pound barbell um, and then I did some chest uh, chest fly with the machine where my uh, forearm is against the pad so I did that and I did the uh, the band uh, actually the band I did it right after I did the uh, the leg press so I, I had set up my uh, little area nobody was there so I set up there and I did it and uh, that was about it and to tell you the truth that took me two hours again I don't freaking know why every time I go it takes me two hours um, I had more energy it's one of those things as you continue uh, with your exercises you have more energy I had energy to do some more but I didn't want to get I'm, I'm already sore with my chest since yesterday when I did the chest fly um, I didn't stretch at all so I felt I'm still feeling it so I had energy to do some uh, reverse fly cable reverse fly uh, I decided not to do it because tomorrow I'm gonna be uh, out with the kids and then um, I don't want to be too sore not only will I be going on a trip with the kids all day and then in the afternoon the school is having a meeting at six o'clock so I'm gonna be out all day dealing with the kids school so uh, yeah I, I have to put I have to remember to bring extra food because uh, not only do I need food for lunch I'm gonna need food uh, to stay until six o'clock I told my husband to come and get me I don't think I'll have energy to take the train back so that's that and then right after the uh, the gym I went to the a uh, little Asian market they have uh, fruits and vegetables and stuff like that I don't know if you guys remember a couple months back I've been craving yams 
but now my cravings is believe it or not is onion of all things onions and then with jalapeno so lately what i've been doing and i'm gonna show you because i'm gonna make it where where did i put that thing oh i took it out of it so i will cut the onion and the jalapeno and then put, uh, squeeze some lime in it and that when i'm eating rice with beans or something i just throw that in it so that is my craving now of all things so I, I, as you can see, I'm almost done with the onion. So what I did is that I stopped at the Asian market, grab some onions. I'm going to make it. There's the onion. And some lime. I don't have lime. I bought two. <laughs> these two cost a dollar. And I already, um, over the weekend, I told my husband to buy the jalapeno. So I have a couple of jalapeno. And... Uh, after that, I stop at the library, grab some books for the kids, especially my oldest because he finishes books. Um, I saw two books uh, look interesting for my youngest. I think he will like it. So I, uh, I bought these two for him, my youngest, but the other two is for my oldest. So let me show you what uh, I'll be doing, how I make that uh, onion with the, uh, uh, with the lime. So let me set up. So one thing I forgot to mention, my kids who lately been really wanting to uh, be involved in uh, cooking, they want me to teach them how to cook and stuff like that. Not that I know how to cook, but um, they really want to be involved in the cooking process. So both of them, surprisingly. Like when um, they like eggs and rice, and they want to make the uh, the eggs, um, they want to help me make the eggs and stuff like that. So I already told them over the summer, I'll be, you know, I'll get them involved more. So lately we've been making our own pizza, but since uh, the spring break, uh, for Easter, we were away, so we didn't do it. So my oldest already remind me about the pizza. He's like, don't forget to make the pizza. So a couple of uh two weeks prior to spring break for some reason they had half a day and um uh, like on a wednesday or a thursday or something like that so i got them involved in making the dough like right now i could have made the dough but my son my oldest already remind me he wants to be part of it and that there's no time um which means tomorrow or maybe tonight, maybe I'll, I'll see how they uh, do with their homework. Because um, tomorrow I'm going to be at their school, and uh, Friday that's when we make the pizza. So uh, I'm going to see if tonight, after they finish their homework, um, they eat and do what they're supposed to do first, and I probably will um, make them, um, I probably will do uh, the pizza dough. Uh, I'll make them help me make the pizza dough tonight. And... Uh, I probably will make extra and freeze it so that way um, you know we could just take it out of the freezer when we need it so that's that um, so um, what I've done here this is the leftover that I had so I decided to remove it so later when I'm eating my rice or beans whatever I, I plan on eating later I'll use it since I'm making fresh one I didn't want the old one to be at the bottom and then um, you know so yeah I uh, clean the onion so I one thing I like to do with it is to cut it very uh, thin um, so when I, I don't have any I don't know I just like it to be thin right and then um, I'm gonna cut some jalapeno and uh, and that's the lime I wash everything already so I'm gonna get going One thing I forgot to do, <laughs> I already used the knife on the onion and the pepper. So I'm, there's a possibility I may not use all of the lime. So let me use a different knife to cut it.
So there it is, my red craving. So this is done. As you can see, I didn't use all of the lime. Sometimes I make, uh, uh, I give my kids uh, lime juice with uh, honey because uh, sometimes they just keep on coughing out of nowhere. So that's sort of help. So that's it. So every time you see me eating uh, onions with rice and jalapeno, that's how I make it.